Hello everyone, Jason from the Game Ball here, and as you can tell right behind me, it's been two days now since the bombs dropped, but luckily right before that happened, we got this bad boy in the mail, which is the Fallout 4 Pip-Boy Edition, and today we're going to be cracking that open and seeing what's inside. So first things first, right on the back here, it says, consult your overseer for more information or refer to an enclosed operational instructions. Fits most human arms. Uh, Luckily, I have human arms, so that's a big plus. Um, so, you'll see that these two clasps on the side here. So, you push those, and this should pop right open. And I feel like it should make almost like a DeLorean like sound effect noise when the DeLorean door opens. Like, um, So, first things first, right on top, we have the game. And what's really awesome is, let me just pop it out here. It comes in this really beautiful steelbook case, and it has the power armor helmet right on the front. So when you crack it open, you get this really cool little like vault dweller's guide, and then even cooler, you get a perk poster, which has all the game's perks right on it. And so that's really, really cool. I'm probably gonna be hanging that up in my room. Oh, and there's also, right underneath that, a little Pip-Boy Operation Instructional Manual. And it's got some really cool art. You can see like the engineers that made the Pip-Boy there. Some other neat little instructions on it in there. Very cool. But here's the, uh, the main attraction here of the Pip-Boy Edition, which is the Pip-Boy itself. And I'm actually gonna set this case down here. Oh, and look at that, there's a there's a stand for it too. So I'm gonna set this down here. Oh, and look at inside this, uh, this Pip-Boy box, it says Made in China, which is really ironic if you play the game. So I don't know how to feel about that, but anyway. So this is the Pip-Boy, really awesome. It's got a bunch of like little working knobs. Um, I believe you can even stick batteries inside of this and uh, you'll have a few LED lights light up on here. It's got a little rad meter because, you know, when the bombs fall, it's not about counting your steps anymore, it's about counting your rads. That's a little more important. And yeah, there's a power button here, but unfortunately I don't have batteries on there, so the lights aren't going to turn on. Alright guys, so let's go ahead and put this bad boy on and see what it looks like. Um, first of all, it has this foam padding on the inside, which is really nice because that makes it really comfortable if you are going to wear this thing. Um, there's also a Velcro strap, which lets you make this as snug as you want and fit your arm in there really nice. Um, also, on the outside, what is really cool is there's this metal clasp, which I didn't expect because most of this is actually made out of plastic. So that makes it look a little fancier, which is awesome. So. Yeah, that's pretty much it guys. Um, like I was saying before, you can stick your phone in there, you can have a second screen experience with your PC, PS4, and Xbox One. And what that'll let you do is while you're playing the game, you can bring up all your items and stats and your map and you can move things around on the go. Um, very cool. I don't think I'll be using this with the game just because it's big and bulky. I'll probably just have my phone next to me. Although I probably will put this on my stand in my room somewhere because it is a cool little conversational piece. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Very cool, guys. Uh, thanks for joining us. Stay tuned to the Game Bolt for anything Fallout related. And until then, we'll see you in the wasteland. See you guys.